Very warm welcome ladies and gentlemen. Today I'm here. My name is Tami Mansar and I'm here to present to you a review about my uh, bike Hero Glamour fuel inject programmed fuel injection. Let's start up with the review from the color. Well, this is the color of my bike. Uh, it's not coffee brown. It's not uh, brown or chocolate brown. Its name is Shield Gold Metallic. It's a new color variant from Hero Motor Group. And uh, the speciality of this uh, my bike, uh, apart from other glamour bikes and other, in fact, other hero bikes, is this badge, which shows uh, programmed fuel injection. It's uh, it means if I means programmed fuel injection. The technology behind this is very simple. The uh, it has an ECU which is controlled by five sensors, for, uh, taking inputs from five different sensors and uh, by calculating it. And then the result is optimum fuel economy, f optimum fuel flow into the engine, which gives better fuel economy and no waste in power, which is very nice. And you can see another technology from Hero Motor Group is this suction valve. What it does is it takes in fresh air and pumps it into the stream of uh, the exhaust gas. So the carbon monoxide is converted into directly CO2, carbon dioxide, which is less harmful in fact. So that's another technology. Then we have got, it doesn't have a carburetor, as you know, it's a fuel injection bike. And this is the kit uh, which delivers the fuel injection capabilities into this engine. And uh, it's a 125cc engine, and it has got four speed constant uh, mesh uh, wet plate uh, transmission system. Uh, it has basically the all basic necessities that you need for a commuter bike. But uh, I have used this bike rather than a commuter. I have used it for long distances, um, mostly. I have uh, to ride to my college of about uh, 49 kilometers one side, which takes about around 100 kilometers daily when I go to the college normally. And now let's look into the console and the, uh, the meter console and other stuff. Well, it's basically uh, completely digital, as you can see. Uh, it shows a fuel injection, uh, the PGMFI, uh, control panel which means if the light is lit it has uh, the uh, the fuel injection system has some problem in it now it's uh, this is a neutral uh, neutral indication light and this is the high beam indication and we have got the we have got one trip meter and another odometer my vehicle has logged about 4849 kilometers in just two months which is pretty good and uh, this is uh, I keep my trip after refueling I just reset my trips after refueling now one digital block uh, represents one and a half liters of petrol now I think there's about uh, four and a half liters of petrol inside this vehicle and above you can see another indication which shows average uh, dot 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 kilometers per liter now this is the cool stuff in this what it does is it now because it's not showing anything uh, the vehicle is in uh, stationary mode uh, what it does is it shows you the exact amount of fuel uh, economy that you can get per liter uh, by the driving habit of the past 10 seconds of what it shows at that moment. Means if this thing is showing you 86 kilometers per liter now, it means that is the mileage you 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 got for the past 10 seconds, past se 10 seconds of your ride. So that's really an amazing thing. So we can adjust our driving habits with uh, with respect to that and uh, i have not added any extra features other than a small box here it's a very small box because not like the conventional big thunderbird boxes uh, i needed a very small box because i keep traveling long distances so i bought this box and uh, they had the color only in red they didn't have any other color so i had to buy this and uh, what it has is just a tire inflation inflator in case of emergency but my tires are filled with nitrogen at the moment and uh, a small uh, uh, raincoat inside it that's all it's got now let's look into some other features like the glove box the glove box is right behind this now i'll show you what all it can carry it's it's an easy and it's a convenient glove box actually now this is how it looks after opening the cowling let's open this neatly packed stuff so i have got the vehicles uh, basic uh, you know the uh, registration papers and other stuffs in this one and I've got a small toolkit and an extra toolkit by myself which includes a player and uh, other stuffs and screwdrivers knife and Swiss knife and all this thing now here I've got a pair of bulbs uh, in case uh, something goes wrong during my long trip night drive because uh, my long trips are basically during night so 
if anything goes wrong with the lights I can easily remove them and fix them on spot now let's just neatly pack it put it back neatly just put it back inside and that's how it looks now we just have to keep it always airtight now let's look into the first aid kit and other stuff so the seat it's got the first aid kit there you go let's put it back and let's close the seat there you go well we've got to lock it from here check it that it's locked and now let's go into how things have been with the with me with this bike I basically maintain it very neat very cool and uh, I've got a very huge f air filter inside this and this ASFS means advanced fuel flow induction system which uh, actually induces fuel and air into the engine in a swirl flow motion just like a swirl it just uh, it creates that swirl inside due to uh, with the help of some kind of technology and uh, some kind of uh, uh, what do you say fluid mechanics uh, stuff they have found out from hero but basically it's a very nice bike now let's look into the digital console mirror once again I have uh, made some very huge uh, uh, success rates in this I have traveled to Palakot in 24 hours time from home and back about 656 kilometers in 24 hours time I had an IV industrial visit in a, in a factory there I it took me about I think six uh, six five hours I guess because uh, 10 o'clock night I left from here morning 3:20 I reached Palakkad it was really nice and some other long trips include going to Nagar Goil from uh, Adur and also to I keep going to Trivandrum which is 98 kilometers from here I, sometimes I even go to Arnaklum which is around 160 kilometers from here so it's really nice it, I, I keep going and doing this kind of stuff hope you all enjoyed me in my show and I uh, hope uh, you guys will also buy this kind of bikes uh, there are for two reasons first is uh, fuel economy second is the contribution that it makes to reduce pollution I mean uh, it gives uh, less CO2 uh, less CO's outside uh, basically the gas is converted into CO2 and that's a very nice bike thank you for uh, being with me once again uh, take care and save uh, ride safely uh, but uh, before going uh, I would like you guys to enjoy my uh, test drive on the road which will be a bit bumpy uh, because I'll be riding the bike and taking the video so please bear with me once again and I uh, hope you all enjoy with this show and uh, let's see you at the test drive bye bye I actually forgot you guys to mention about the mileage that I get in this bike normally if you're riding between these green panel which is the economy zone at fourth gear I get about 83 to 89 kilometers per liter and if I am cruising between 60 and 80 over here 60 and 80 I get a cruising means continuously cruising for more than let's say 10 minutes more than 10 minutes continuously and uh, I normally cruised up to one hour continuously at that speed and the mileage uh, that it showed me it gradually increased up till 81 up till 81 which is very nice it started from 62 and it uh, reached till 81 which is uh, very nice because it gradually increased as the speed was kept constant but the time kept on increasing and the mileage also kept on increasing so this shows that the fuel injection uh, ports inside the vehicle adjust the airflow and the fuel inje uh, fuel injection into the engine uh, very uh, you know it's controlled uh, meter it's m metered and controlled very uh, systematically so that the fuel is burned completely and uh, less fuel is burned and more air is induced into the engine giving it more time to breathe and more uh, oxygen rich air uh, basically on an average if i fill 410 rupees i run sometimes if i'm uh, riding within the city I get a, mi a mileage 410 rupees is like uh, 98 which 110 rupees means at today's rate I get one and a half liters of petrol and uh, in one and a half liters I get about 96 97 kilometers and if I am riding uh, in, uh, in, a, in a highway in a cruising mode uh, let's say in a, in a nice cruising mode then in 110 rupees uh, I get about 121 122 kilometers which is more than uh, the exact amount of how much we have filled the petrol so it's not even uh, one rupee per per kilometer so which it, it is really nice so e even the average fuel indica indication system helps us to 
you know improve our driving habits according to that so let's go to the test drive back uh, I'm really sorry for uh, cutting this video and putting it uh, at the end of the review video bye bye Hi, ladies and gentlemen this is Tommy from Star I'm uh, coming to you live from uh, one of the most hostile conditions of uh, riding a bike uh, uh, in this condition it's really amazing to see that uh, I'm riding uh, the fog is really much dense that I can't even see the road ahead. It's uh, barely 100 meters as you can see the fog is very thick. I can't see anything uh, other than another 20-25 meters. So it is really necessary for me to uh, be alert. So look at the fog around me. And it's very thick. It's very very thick. And uh, I'm riding through these conditions. Uh, the temperature is around uh, 26 degrees centigrade. Over within those uh, smooth as uh, the speed has to be kept between uh, uh, 40 and 45 uh, and uh, between 30 in fact that's good mileage also to be shown and, uh, there's nothing uh, peculiar about this walk even some of the road conditions are not favorable uh, for riding in these conditions so hope everyone enjoy the show uh, see you soon on uh, HLTV once again this is Tamim Ansar signing off goodbye and take care and a safe ride also HLTV coming to you one on one live. I'm Tami Mansara riding on my Hero Glamour fuel injection. The fuel injection badge and this vehicle is now giving me a mileage of 199 kilometers per liter uh, because I was coming down a steep hill at uh, around uh, 50, 40, 40 kilometers per hour. It gives me a mileage of 81.0. Uh, actually, it is supposed to increase depending upon the variation in weight. Uh, basically, what happens is that the uh, vehicle has a very better uh, plush momentum in terms of uh, higher configurational uh, capabilities. It is a very nice vehicle, basically. It can travel uh, up to 98-99 km per hour and it gives a good mileage of around uh, 75 to 80 km per liter. So, I hope you all enjoy what. Uh, how everything is going on thank you for being with me once again have a very safe trip and uh, ride safely bye bye